Hey guys, welcome to Skyrim Sundays. Last ep, we did finally the Stormcloak in Chains quest. We finally got Finny up to a sufficient speechcraft level that we were able to complete it. We are going to head back to Bruma uh, and do all these other quests, but along the way, we're going to just step into some of these places we haven't been to. Like, I want to try and find out what this place is, and then just meander on back up to Bruma and see if there's anything that we missed along the way. I don't think Plunder Mine really counts, because it might have to be something I go that way for, because that's Gautier Manor, yeah. Might go to Bruma and then maybe do these guys first before we head around this way and find out what else is around this mountain before we head out further back to, say, the Frozen Grotto and uh, Cedar, which we have not been to. So, short story, we're going this way. <laughs> we're heading around and then to Bruma. Because I feel like we've missed out on some of the main plot lines of this DLC mod. <laughs> mod, I think is probably the better term, because we didn't have enough speechcraft. And now that we do have sufficient speech craft, we can continue with these main plot lines and see what this mod really has to offer. I feel like we've just done a lot of the smaller token quests because we didn't have the capacity to do these bigger ones. So I'm pretty excited to have at least the opportunity to see if there is more to this. Why am I going west? Oh no, west is the right direction, idiot. I was the east in my head. Okay, so we want to go down sort of this way. That cave is the Serpent's Trail, which we've been to. I'm just trying to find the main path to follow down. It's kind of here-ish. Oh, here we go. Right at my feet. What do you know? And, yeah, try and find what this object is. Oh, I remember you. I'm still sorry for your loss, and I don't know who you are or what you were doing. I'm surprised you haven't, like, frozen over given the weather. Should I be deviating here? No, it's further down. You know what? Screw as a crow. Uh, screw going down the path. We'll go as the crow flies. It's so much quicker. You never know what you can find going cross country in this joint. Look at that. Shaved off two minutes of my time. Nothing there? No, it's just random cliff face. Ah, reminds me how beautiful this place is. Look at it. And there's Bruma. Oh, this place is beautiful. Anyway, where are we deviating? Kind of here-ish, but not. I'll start over. Oh yeah, this is like a path actually. Oh shit. Who or what are you? Of course you're a wolf. I wouldn't be a wolf. Seriously, Sophia, one hit kills. Not cool. Well, I mean, not cool when you do it. It's far cooler when I do it. Uh. Curved down and around, maybe? Yeah, shit. Hey, my kill. Um, okay, if you want to swing blindly like that, that's your prerogative. So what is here exactly? Okay, well, humans have been here at some point. For this... Kind of catapult like structure to be here. Oh my god, I thought it was getting lighter, but it's not. It's getting dark. Might need some new light, Finny. Up, I think, and around. Yes. Well, it looks like we. I mean, it's nothing on my mat. Are you serious? Oh, yes, this looks like a, a ruin of some kind. Remove it. No, I want to get rid of. There we go. So it's definitely a ruin. And it's come to my attention that these aren't actually Dwemer ruins like I thought. They're probably like alien ruins. Surely they're alien ruins. Because the Dwemer don't really seem to be prevalent in Bruma or even Cyrodiil so much from what I can tell of the place. Oh. Oh, we have to continue up. Right. We've just got a uh, shrine here. Hey buddy, how's it going? You seem a bit dead, I suppose is the best word. Oh, you too. What's in this chest? Absolutely nothing of interest. Wonderful. I love it when you guys do that for me. What are you, what are you even doing here? I'm so confused right now. Anywho, let us head up 
towards what I think must be surely an alien ruin. Surely that itself is racist. I'm not racist. Okay. No, I just don't like Adidas. Oregonians. I've heard this conversation before. Shouldn't like anybody but nods. I'm not that fond of orcs, red guards, or imperials either. What is this place? Cloud Ruler Temple discovered. Don't take it personally. Oh, this damn fighting music hasn't freaking stopped. I just realized. I uh, I've had this from before, but I don't remember how I solved it. It's getting really annoying because I don't get to hear the Bruma music. And some of the game sounds aren't appearing as a result. Oh well. Cloud Ruler Temple. I'm sure that would make a lot more sense if I'd actually played Oblivion. It sounds like the kind of place that has meaning. Kind of nice in a sort of rundown kind of way. Can Balit. Okay. Oh, well something tragic has clearly happened here. Um. Hi. I think maybe I should try to figure out my music problem because you seem like you have some sort of like dramatic music happening. So we've got a great hall. East wing and presumably a west wing. Okay. Oh, the west wing's blocked. Let's just take the main hall. Hi. Anyone home? You! Yeah! This is a war zone! What are you doing here? Fine. If you won't leave, go. Find Alina. Tell her we need her at the front, immediately. Bruh, I don't even know who you are and what you want. The way home. Nestled high in the Gerald Mountains, I found the ruins of Cloud Roller Temple, the ancient home of the Blades. Oh! Okay. And now they live at that place in Skyrim, whatever the hell it was called. Okay. In order of worries in the service of the Emperor, a disembodied voice warned me that the place was a war zone. Um, is he, like, not realizing how much time has passed since he died? And asked that I make myself useful by finding a woman named Alina and telling her to join him on the front line. Find Alina. Yeah, given that it was a disembodied voice, this place looks like absolute crap. And the fact that the blades haven't been around for quite some time. I'm gonna say they're dead. Just putting it out there. Oh, hey, skeleton. Wait, what was that? A worn Akaviri. What? I really need to look at shit before I start taking it. Weapons. Oh my god. Oh no, I forgot to go to a town and sell shit. Well, I'm not going to pick up much, am I? Worn Akaviri Katana. This sort of seen better days. <laughs> wow! I want a Katana. That sounds so cool. Well, apparently we have to go through that door. What if I don't want to go through that door? Fine, we'll go through the door. It's not like there's anything else here anyway. I might turn my torch off. Get some more authentic lighting happening. East Wing. Maybe I should have... Holy crap! Um, I think my game's bugged. Um, Alina? Hi, Alina? How did I fail? I found Alina. She's dead. No one said I had to find her alive. Wait. Alina, she's... dead? Well, she's very active if you ask me. She's you'll dancing on the ceiling. You'll have to hold my rear, but you'll stand no chance with that weapon. Grab one of the old consecrated blades. <laughs> Glenroy should do. From the armory. Meet me in the West Wing with Glenroy's blade, and we'll make our final stand. Why is it always my games that are bugged? <laughs> oh, she is going insane. Retrieve Glenroy's Akaveri Katana. That's great. I will do that. I'll get right on that. Let me just check out this place first. See what I can, like, loot. Oh, the books are ruined. That's depressing. Shut up up there, Alina. You're making too much noise. Oh, it's a tankard if I want a tankard. Okay, it looks like I can go this way. So you're a real smooth talker. Apparently huh? I am now. Well don't think you can talk to Oh that's the me. wing door. I know all the moves. I probably invented half of them. Wouldn't surprise me. Armory. Okay, let's find this katana. Who were the Akaviri, by the way? I don't really know the answer to that. Hi, you just kinda like died. Excuse me, Sophia. Move a bitch. Oh, Snipe just a shit ton of dead people. Well, this is Gle Gle what's his name? Glenroy's ancient katana. Sorry, Akaviri katana. I'm just aging him. Elvin! Elven! Why are you guys. <gasps> Raslan! I found your body! Dude, do you know you're dead? I mean, obviously not, but. I found your body! I can bring it with me if you like. <laughs> 
Do a bit of a show and tell. Oh, I didn't see you there. Thank you. I'm getting quite the katana armory myself. Okay, we're gonna go back up and around. Back the way we came, I suspect. Oh, no, apparently not the way we came. Hello, oh, no. yeah, I am. Let's try and get over here. West Wing. You're here. Why are you not wielding Glenroy's Hi! This is an ancient and revered weapon. Dishonor our order. Oh, was I supposed to be equipping it? I'm spurning it. You're here. Ah, oh, for the love of God, I'll equip your stupid weapon. I am a priestess with divine magic. I don't wield weapons, my friend. I'm just not that kind of girl. You know? Not real. Happy. Right, let's go. Dude, what are we killing? Ah! Poor Vinny. Uh, he's dead. He's been dead for quite some time. Who's he? And the roof. Rubble. Corvin. I. He's dead. Alina is dead. You're dead too, They're buddy. Dead. In the roof. I don't know how many years have passed since you were alive. Tell me what happened here. You did as well, Roslyn. I found a skeleton in the armory. Wait, you don't know that you're dead? You're like translucent. Should I question or pretty much just tell him? Dead. Why does everyone fall down staircases in the hills? My skeleton. Tell us no. The cloud ruler temple is lost. Very much so. The blades are broken. Again, very much so. My order is no more. Well, That's I mean, I. loosely Thank speaking, you they can showing be showing me the truth, friend. Reformed in Skyrim? Me endless torment. Now I fear that the truth now is. Now go much into the light, company. my friend. Meet me back in the great hall. Or not. There are rites to perform. Perhaps then I'll be able to feel RK's embrace at last. Can you at least tell me what happened? Like, why are you dead? I'm getting a lot of blades armor here. Oh, I should probably um unequip that. I always miss the people I break up. Um I want that and that's still equipped. Awesome. Need to learn to win better with my bow. But seriously though, like, what? How did he not know that time had passed and that he was dead? It seems a bit strange. Oh, for God's sake, music! You, you're really spoiling the atmosphere. Oh, I hope that time wasn't. Oh, hey! Place our blades into the fire. Oh, it's Alina and Corvin. Spirits. Grant us rest in Aetherius. Set three blades, spirits free. Yeah, about that. I'm not very accurate at uh, tossing stuff. Oh, okay, I, I don't have to. Brilliant. Place the blades. The fire burns brightly before you. Raslan asks that you place the blades of the three ghostly blades members into the fire so that they may rest in peace. Place Corvin's Akaviri Katana into the fire. Talos protect you, friend. Thank you for releasing me. You're welcome. May you rest in peace. Wherever the bloody hell you going. Leave. Wait. I don't have anyone else's? Oh. Oops. Apparently. <gasps> oh, he's gone. Uh, be right with you guys. I forgot to get your swords, apparently. My bad. Alina's still having fits. Oh, no wonder I didn't see it. I mean, come on. That thing is, like, dark as all heck. Oh, God. Let's leave. She's going to kill us all. And then, okay, apparently even though your body was back there, you were saying that your katana is this way? Where? I already got Corvin's. I already got Corvin's sword. I don't know. Let's, let's just go and get rid of Alina. Place Alina's katana there. Thank you. Gods guide you. Bye. Maybe. Oh, I can't see the old sections, damn it. Maybe it was back where his body was. Because I don't remember getting... Yeah, I didn't get a blade when I 
looted his body. So we'll go back to where I found him. Try not to get killed by Alina. Alina's uh, spirit on the way. And head on down. And hopefully his sword's going to be just lying on the ground like that. Uh-huh. There's no way I would have seen that with the darkness resolution on my screen. It's just way too dark. Oh god, is she picking up swords now? You're a serious safety hazard, love. Okay, here we go. Razlan, it's all you, babe. It's all you. Thank you, my friend. Now, let us speak. You have freed us, friend. You have my eternal thanks. You may keep Glenroy's blade. Oh, thanks! My soul will empower it. It is an ancient artifact of our order. But our order is broken. Use it to uphold our legacy. Might have to give it to Sophia. Hey! Glenroy's empowered Akaviri Katana. Well, it's a mouthful. Added. Completed. Away home. Aww. That was really short and sweet. Deals 10 points of fire damage and 10 extra points of damage against dragons. Well, about that. I'm kind of in Bruma where there don't seem to be any dragons. So I don't know how well that's going to go. 12 damage. That's probably should tell unless someone yours does. Would it be wrong if I was physically attracted to you even though you're a woman? No. Sorry. I was it's thinking not wrong. I mean... Just ignore anything I just said. I, as a person, well, don't swing that way, wanted? but yep. I don't know which way Finny goes. I, I really don't. Oops. I dropped something. <laughs> just kidding. Finny, what have you got? Nine. Oh, but I really like that sword. It was really cool. Okay, fine. You may have this one that's slightly better. Glen Roy's powered Akaveri Katana, which does 12 damage. There we go. See, you happy. I'm glad that's sorted. Roslan, someone's using your sword. Well, let's get the hell out of here. This place is weird. But there you go, guys. That was Cloud Rule of Temple, which again, probably makes more sense if you have Blade Oblivion. Of course, it's night time. We spent almost six hours in there. Surprise, surprise. So, now that we discovered this awesome place, which I knew was a place on the map, We'll continue to manually find our way down to Bruma and check out anything else we come across along the way. But I don't think there are any more caves or fun places of interest between here and Bruma. Especially if I like jump off the cliff and, and, and just do it quick the quick way. Yeah, there doesn't appear to be anything extra on the map. Per se. They're all on my map. I mean, I haven't been to them, but they're physically on my map. Doesn't look like there's anything extra. Just going this way a little bit to double check that there's none that I've missed this way, but no, it doesn't look like there's anything. Hey, Moosey Moose or Deer or whatever you're calling yourself. Oh, hey! Oh, that's right, we've never been to this watchtower. Get out of my way. You know how there was the stables, oh shit, and stuff? Oh, that's that chick's camp. We never actually went to this watchtower. That's what I'm thinking of. Oh, maybe it isn't. I thought there was a watchtower, like, right next to Bruma. Or maybe it's the western watchtower I'm thinking of. Where are you, sir? You seem quite a distance away, because I cannot physically see you. Hi. I still cannot see you. Where are you? Aha! Found you. And let's go mountain climbing. Mountain sliding. It's oh shit. I suppose it's more up to. Him. Hey guys. I come in peace. Just you know. Coming down the mountain side like a normal human being. It's total normal behaviour. Whew, okay. Bruma Eastern Okay, so it is the Eastern Watchtower. Wonderful. And as I said, it seems like the sound is affected by the damn music. Anyway, a, a, a chick with an E at the beginning of her name should be here. I've heard of this mystical natural e. wonder known as the Fountain of Booze. 
Do you think the stories are no, true? No, I really don't think it's sure a real hope thing. So. If I ever found it, I would never go sober again. Okay, there's someone here, but they just look like normal broomer guards. Here we are, Araya. Garcia's been filling your head full of goblin dung. Well, he was an Don't interesting fellow. Him. We're the best and brightest out here. Who's this Garcia that you've been talking about? Well, we found him already. He's one of those people he's in who the thinks that because he's been doing it for the longest, he must be the best. Oh dear, I he can't see he's face the one that thing. and his guards, who protect Bruma the most vigorously from the gravest threats. But he couldn't be more wrong. Obviously. He may have been out here longer, but we're just better. Okay. They're having a pissing Bye. contest. Bye. I mean, Garcia's asked me to find him a sword. You never asked me to find you a sword. Guess who's my favorite? Uh, as I said, when we head into Bruma, I'm going to start doing some of the more miscellaneous quests, like asking about rumors and stuff, because I never did that before because I wasn't interested in it. I wanted to do just like core plot. But now that I found myself able to do some of the core plots, plot points, I think I want to just find out every little small part of this mod. Every little addition that they've made, every little quest that they've given, no matter how miscellaneous. So me finally, I could totally fast travel at this point, you know. Ah, whatever. We're here already. We may as well manually go see the wonder that is Brother. Hey, speaking of stables, did we ever talk to the lady? No, it's the missing horse. Oh, that's right. She didn't want to give up her money because the hay was dodgy or something like that. Oh. No, I won't chat to her. We've already chatted to her. Let's just head in. I'm going to be on the lookout for any taverns. Are you a courier? Why are you running at me like that? I've been looking for you. Bar courier. I've got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Oh, uh -huh. Let's see. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. Oh, is asking me to hang out the for too travels. long. Looks like that's it. Got to go. I won't be doing that, but thank you anyway. Heard there were beasts around. Be careful, traveler. Really? What kind? That's no good. So I want to go nope. to like sorry Nothing. inns and stuff to get more miscellaneous. Qu What's the time of day again? Oh. Is anyone even going to be awake? Well, I suppose in inns they might. Look at the rest, restful watchman? Is that what it's called? Hey, God. Yeah, the restful watchman. And now that I've got persuasive abilities, I can speak to damn crouchers. Oh, hi. I don't know you. Uh, but crouchers, crouchers, crouchers. Is. Ah, it's Christian Songwen. Uh, Reno indicated that he would be willing to tone down his constant performances if I returned his prized loot to him. Apparently stolen by thieves. Ha! Huh. Gonna suspect that's Crouchers. He didn't give me much to go on. Perhaps I should ask him if he has any idea of the corporate's identities. And it's this optional ask about Reno's loot at the watchful... Restful watchman. And I have to find the loot. And Crouchers was my biggest you? lead, but he wouldn't talk to me because my uh, speech craft sucked. I mean, do you? Uh-huh. Give me a sec while I just chat to Crouchers. Oh. Do you know anything about the loot? Even if I did, why would I tell you anything? Oh, I think it's so too late. I might have like screwed the this up. Saint you are and tell the guards. <laughs> I don't no. think it's gonna trigger. Oh no, here we go. It's time. It's to make him shut up. Oh really? Well, in that case. Hey! I I oh, I forgot to turn my lamp off. Why aren't so bright? We kicked that old horker out of here a little while back. Can still hear him from his house across the way. It'd be nice to get rid of that nuisance. Damn straight. Here's the truth. Yes. I told oh, color me surprised. Out of fine oak and encrusted with some rubies. Wait, rubies in a loot? Gold, friend. Wow. So I sold it to some of my most prolific business partners. I'm not surprised at all. Where are these business partners? Capstone Cave. Again? It's not too far from. Brooklyn. I've already been there. That's why they're going to respawn. Them. Either Ugh. they'll kill you or you'll kill them makes no difference to me our business has already concluded. you don't want to deal with them in future However, I have a smarter proposal such as we drove Renard out of the watchman and he's no doubt had the same happen at the Gerald oh yeah the Gerald he does not like him at all out of work I'm sure you've seen the hilarious bardic masterclass posters he's putting up all around Bruma in the hope of keeping a room no I haven't but okay 
Tell him he's got a new venue to play at. Tell him to go to Capstone and play. Those boys have been looking for some entertainment for a while now. What? You'll have to negotiate it with them at the cave first. Are they gonna kill him? If you do that, either they keep him and Renard is successfully out of Ruma. Oh. Or they oh. punish him. Oh. And no one's any the wiser. Um. I'm going to Capstone Cave. I'll go and find him a job. I'll go, but I'm getting the loot. Ugh. Finny would totally just get the loot, but I don't necessarily need to tell Crouches that. As you should. Which option you decide yeah, he doesn't really care which way concern. I do it. That's fine. Negotiate him a job or retrieve the loot by force. Doesn't matter much to me. Just don't drag me Okay. Into this My only interest in Renard is well, yeah. to shut up. This is not. If there's any chance that he could die while at Capstone Cave, Finny most definitely would not do that. Sorry, I was reading at the same time. Get the bandit ring there to hire me on a said, or I've still got the mission of getting the loot myself. So we're probably going to go to Capstone and just get the loot. Oh, hey, buddy. Why do I need to speak to you? Oh, Maki Ovaka. I don't know that Maki was there before, but yeah, you're the chick that I killed. Ah, I don't know his name. I killed a bandit dude for her. Cornelius. Him. Is he dead? He is very dead. Then here's your payment, as promised. This is the part where I go seek my fortune in the Imperial City, I guess. Jealous. 500 gold. Hey, completed. And you, you I need to speak to. Mm. Oh, I can't speak to him anymore. Maybe I need to go speak to Adius again. Adius wanted me to speak to Bantior. Didn't he? What did I need to speak to Bantior about? Bye. What were you? Oh, find a way to pressure bands you want to give me information about Count Carvain's lost Akaviri heirlooms. Uh, oh yeah, I was approached by idiots. Maybe I have to speak to Mind idiots about you, it. The restful watchman. Rooms and food, that's what we do. Okay. What do you need? Well, had any rumors? A little birdie told me that you're annoying me. Okay, that's not gonna work. Uh, I'm looking for bounties. There is something actually. Here, the powers that be at the county castle sent out this bounty letter. Okay. Bounty decree added. Kill the bandit ringleader at Plundered Mine. Well, hey, I didn't say I had to go to Plundered Mine shortly. Do you ever run into trouble, given your tavern's shady reputation? Well, honestly, sometimes I do. I'm only saying this because I suspect you might oh, be able to help quest. me out. Oh, it's another quest. See, there's this snooty Altmer that came through here a few days back. One of those haughty Alinor types. Newcomer to Bruma. Well, he came here, not realizing that the Gerald view might have been more to his tastes. After he witnessed uh -huh. a few of our, oh, you know, morally gray activities, morally gray activities. and an exceptional display of promiscuity, <laughs> well, he decided to leave. I am unsurprised. Now, in his outrage and disgust, He's planning to try and press charges against my tavern. Oh, what? Being a if you tavern? Could just talk him down. I'd appreciate it. Yeah, sure. Um, yeah. Great. Sounds He's like an idiot. He's probably storming around town right now, trying to rabble rouse against the Watchmen. Put a stop to it. Yeah, I mean, I'm okay with that. Convince Serendil not to press charges against Bentio. Who is Goodbye. Serendil? I don't know that I've even met this fellow. Oh, Sophia, we're leaving. I mean, of course, everyone's going to be in their beds at this hour. So I don't think I'm going to find him. I should probably, you know, convince Serendil. Definitely don't do that. God, we really need to, like, get rid of some of these things. And Screeching Songman. I have to go back to... Ah, Capstone Cave. So where is this... Yeah, you don't say. Local map. Oh, it looks like he's outdoors. That means I can speak to him. He's just outside the Gerald View Inn. Wonderful. Sophia, come. Hey, Gort. My weapon wants to Yeah, a I remember you actually Things wanted me to do wanna something, didn't them. you? And I said, like, yeah, no, cut Fetch your three iron ingots three... To Actually, I might have some in my inventory. In my killing, so I know who needs killing. Oh, I don't know where your book then of killing is. Gold. Okay, sure. Good. My killing arm's itching to do more killing. Finny... <laughs> Finny's happy to help. Oh, no. I thought I had some iron ingots. I mustn't. Ingots, ingots, ingots. Oh, I've got a gold ingot. 
and a quicksilver ingot, and a silver ingot, and a steel ingot, everything else but the bloody iron. Can I buy it? But wait, where's your book? Fetch Gort's Book of Killing from Boreal Stone Cave. Oh, I have not discovered this place. Cool, well when I head that way, I will find it. Probably after Capstone Cave, I'll kind of do this area. Bruma Caverns. Bruma Caverns? How did I not discover that and not realize what it was? Huh. Anywho, okay, so that's what I have to do to help Gort out. Finny's such a helpful person, isn't she? I want to go this way. Anyway, let's catch Serendil because he appears to be out of doors. Have you ever tried bareback? I Where? Don't like it. it started oh, to there. make me a little sore the after a while. The name is not familiar. What's with the funny face? I was talking Hi. about horse riding. Serendil, I really don't think I've spoken to you. Hello. Hi. Ben Tua wants you to drop the charges. Huh, I must have spoken to him before. Happen, I'm afraid. What's your problem with the rest of Watchmen? DD squad filled with criminals, rats, and lice. The amount of underhanded deals and crooked business that goes on there, it beggars belief. I wanted the proprietor of the land in hot water with our dear guard. So just go to the Gerald View Inn. No. Like, dude, no one's Say, pressuring you to go there. Could you help me with that? No. Oh my. So this is what I must have said to him originally. Why exactly should I help you? Should help me because the tavern is filled with criminals. They deal with bandits. They steal. They rob. Having been part of the thieves' guild in the life, I'm okay with that. I am not used to being refused. I recognize that, yeah. But so be it. So he won't drop the charges either. Ha! That isn't going to happen, I'm afraid. Okay, well, let's go chat back to Bentio, although it's still telling me to talk to this dude. How do I convince him? Oh, do I have to like go along with his little quest and and pretend to, or actually do what he wants me to do? But I don't want to get this place closed down. I like this place. It's got its own little charm. What's on your mind? Not you, Bentio. Bentio, he said no. Mm -hmm. He said I haven't actually done this this conversation point. And go over to the Gerald View if it suits you better. Me, I think this inn has more character than Mr. Stantis Fancy Pants' little establishment. I do agree with you there. Anywho, so the dude didn't want to cooperate. Talk to you later. Okay. I might have to at least agree with that dude. To get it to progress. But... What would the end result be? It's not like I actually want to cripple the rest of the Watchmen. Well, no one says I have to actually do it. I can just say that I agree to do it and then not actually do it. Okay, buddy. Hmm? It's a DD squad. I wanted the proprietor of the land in I'll do it. Excellent. As it so happens, I'm a mage by trade. Okay. I have access to many okay. magical items from my home of Alanor. Take this. It's a very special memory gem. I have one active at all times. And this particular one recorded everything that happened in the tavern that night. Take it and let the guard captain listen to it. Irrefutable evidence. I'm sure he'll see fit okay. to take action then. Okay. Can I listen to it? What was it called? It seems like a memory gem or a... God, I can't believe I've still got Meridian's beacon just chilling there. Here you go, Serendil's memory gem. Equip? I don't think that'll really work. I don't think I can do anything with it. It's just like a gem. No, can't What's do that snot-brained oh, Alper God. doing Ooh, here? Loud. This is no place for one of them. You don't think he's Thalmor, do you? Oh, no, I am listening to doesn't it. doesn't seem the sort. But he's still not the right type for our little den. Might bring the wrong kind of attention. So what do we do? Stabbing him would be... excessive, so... I know. Why don't we treat him to a little show of our favorite lusty Argonian maid? <laughs> Perfect. Let's go fetch her. Here, take this coin. Oh, I'd like no. to buy a little show for my Altmer friend and over there. More promiscuous than usual. Sure thing. Oh, one other thing. He wanted you to roleplay as Lifts Her Tail, you know, from. <laughs> Altmer. Always the same fantasy. 
Sure thing. Hey, darling. I heard you wanted a date with Lifter Tail. What is the meaning of this? Lifter Tail? What a ridiculous name for an even more ridiculous... Oh my! Xarxus's breath! What an oblivion are you doing? I demand that you put that back on! Ariel, give me strength! Cease and desist! I demand that you cease and desist at once, you cretinous lizard woman! Stop jiggling about! I can't take this anymore! I think I'm going to faint! Oh I think... Ah! Oh. Ha! <laughs> it worked! Otis, you really are a genius. <laughs> I know. Sop didn't even know what hit him. Ha! <laughs> they breed them special in Eleanor, don't they? <laughs> and you want me to bring that to Adius? I really don't think Adius is gonna care. He's probably gonna chuckle anyway. Hey, Adius, are you asleep, by the way? Are you gonna be in the car? Is this Adius right here in front of me? Hey, Adius! Within the walls, we'll keep Dude. you safe. Outside, Don't watch your own away from me. Us guards, we're uh, well trained. We miss okay. nothing. Okay, I've got other things I want to talk mind. to him about, but I have his memory gem. It's a recording of the events in the Restful Watchmen. Oh, well, this should be interesting. Oh, it is. Trust me. Let's listen. It's brilliant. They. What do you think, Adius? Well, that's certainly very. Interesting. I know, right? I'm not sure Very interesting. there's much in there that I can take action on. Tell our Altmer friend that I'm very sorry. Yup. I am more than happy to do that. Don't run away too far. I'm going to need you in a sec. Let me just find out Altmer friend, who is not going to be happy about that at all. Oh, where has he gone? Inform Sarandil that no charge has been brought against Ventio. Have you played back the memory gems recording for the captain? When is he arresting that damnable innkeeper? The car captain said there's nothing in there that can be used against Bentio. Zarxus' backside. I'm leaving this awful town. Go I've for it. No one wants you here. Cyrodiil. I'm returning to Alinor. At least there I'm not assailed by lustful lizards. Lustful lizards. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. Okay, Bentio. Your plan is a bit of a success. And Crouches. Maybe we should tell Crouches that his plan succeeded. Uh, I can't believe it's nice. Nice thinking, though, guys. You really deserve praise for your thought process there. Uh, Bentio, you want to come down the stairs, mate? Because you're gonna fall down them anyway. When we Abgal, chat. You here to do business? Uh, Serendil has left. No charges can be brought against you. Uh, that's good to hear. Thank you. Here, take a little bit of coin on the house. Oh, and have this. It's a leftover memory gem that one of the guys took out of the elf's pocket when he was passed out on the floor. Might fetch a decent sum. Oh, thanks. Ventura, it just occurred to me that your mouth doesn't actually move when you speak, which is really uncanny. Okay, so he's not going to See you around. let up on the heirlooms. I'm going to, have to speak back to Adius. There was an option in Adius's dialogue about that one, so I can head back to Adius and... Get a start there. Um, what's time? Oh, I don't have much more time to play. Sorry, guys. But who is this? Hi. Oh, the courier is. Nope. Sorry. Just nothing. Chilling, doing nothing. Okay, uh, I need to find Adius. I might have to. Uh. Do I have a quest that can help me find Adius? There you go. I can, if I put that on... Okay, he's gone back to the castle. I can find him! Apparently I've got many got things I need to speak to Adius about. It was all my idea, Which is course. fine. Oh, I can show Actually, you it's like? got the jar of you in. I was going to talk Whoa, about rumors first. I didn't mean on me. I was stalking about in you. Are you the jar of you in? Yeah, here we go. So I want to ask Stantis, isn't it, about some rumors? Are you coming over or am I going to have to move to you? I'm careful not to steal shit. Stantis! If you want food or drink, I can show you our menu. Need any work done? As it happens, yes, I do. I need the shipping mood. request delivered to Greenwood. Oh, I okay. The courier is unavailable. If you're able to act in his stead, I'll reward you with coin. Yeah, it's fine. I mean, I've been to Greenwood. They're really nice Excellent. people down there. Take this to Afur Formalius at Greenwood. Down where the Gerals meet the Great Forest. 
I'll deliver payment on your return. Yeah, no worries. I, I'm happy to do that, actually. Fine. Wait, do you have any more rumors? Welcome to the Gerald View. What can I... I heard the city guard are trying to crack down on smuggling. And too many illicit goods making their way to Skyrim. <gasps> oh, and I was an Empire unintentional like hand in that. Oops, any more? You know that bard, Renat Eventone? Okay, nothing else yeah. interesting. Fair enough. Who, wait, who are you? To watch over and entertain their Who's spoken to Ambrick? I'm Ambri. Ambri the bard. No, I haven't spoken Can to you. For a song? Um, I didn't see you around here before. You wouldn't have. Stantis recently hired me to replace who was, by all oh. accounts, particularly disagreeable. But no, Arnus Bright Eyed could have worked here. Uh, I assume you're referring to Renat Eventone. Yes, by all accounts, quite a shocking excuse for a bard. But I wouldn't even I'm call not him here a to bard. pass judgment on others. I'm here to entertain. So, want a song? Uh, sure. Is there a... Sorry, it, my cursor is telling me the way. Where'd you learn to play? Back home in High Rock. Uh, away rest, to be specific. Great place. A real bastion of the arts. Lots of talented musicians back there. Oh, you should head there sometime. They even have a menagerie. Though, it may have moved on by now. Well, that'd be pretty cool to see. Is there a bastion of the arts in Cyrodiil? Well, nowhere compares to what's in High Rock, of course. Ah, though perhaps that's just my affinity for Breton. I mean, it could be. <laughs> well, there's the Nern Theater. Ah, oh, that's right, the Nern Theater. Just outside the walls of the Imperial City. Yeah. Other than that, not much for That's to something mind, you're going to be able to do, I'm sure, once oh, more of the, the, the mod is available. Because we had that note about it. I think I actually just sold it off, off screen before. <laughs> but yeah, the Nern Theater seems like it might be something we are. Yeah we'll be able to do in the future. Now, Adius is going to take a, a while to sort through all the things and just speak to him about, so I might just hold off and do that one in the next step, because we have covered quite a lot of ground in this episode. Thanks so much for watching us up, guys. If you'd like to give a thumbs up, and I'll see you next Skyrim Sunday or Saturday, depending on how I feel.